What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Hey, babe. Hey, baby. <laughs> All right, I brought Nathan with me today because we are gonna do something a little weird. Yes, yeah, different. <laughs> a little unconventional. So I love the brand Milk Makeup. They are in Sephora. They are a really cool company from New York. Now, they have a holographic highlighter that I love. And recently, they put out a bunch of new stuff. They have all these crazy, like, sticks. One is a blur stick, one is a cooling water stick, and then I was scrolling and I found something I think Nathan might love. <laughs> Do you even know what this is? No, I, I really don't. Mil milk makeup. <laughs> so these are roll and blotting sheets. Roll and blot. Now, Nathan is a cannabis connoisseur. How long have you been rolling uh, joints for, or blunts, or anything? Uh, probably like eight years or something <laughs> like that. Right, okay, so these, I'm like, oh my god, if anyone is gonna try this out, it's gonna be Nathan. So these are called the Roll and Blot Papers. Now, milk is cruelty-free, which is cool for everyone out there that always asks me about that. So basically, these are unbleached hemp papers. Now, not only are they allegedly supposed to remove excess oil and shine, they can also be used as rolling papers. <laughs> so I thought, okay, let's try them out. Let's see if this stuff works. So we're kind of gonna do a little first impressions on all of these things. Um, so I'm on Sephora.com right now, and it says that these are portable, soothing blotting sheets made from unbleached hemp fibers to absorb excess oil, reduce shine without disturbing your makeup. Oh, okay. And they also help purify pores and keep your skin looking clean, refreshed, and, and snatched. And snatched. <laughs> <laughs> and refined. Um, so I guess this is also paraben free, sulfate free, bitch, it's everything free. It's eco conscious and it's innovative, which I kind of live for. All right. Snap. Snap, pop, and whirl. I'm like really excited to try these out. I think we should try these first. Okay, and... so I guess we'll blot our, each other's faces with one. Yes. Now, should we smoke our own oil, everybody? I wish there could be a poll right now, but <laughs> I think we're gonna, I mean, I think we should roll a normal one, mm -hmm. and then we'll, yeah, yeah. we'll we'll try to roll, well, I'm not gonna roll, I do not know how to roll anything. He's gonna roll one with the oil. I'm down to smoke your oil, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I'm down to smoke yours. Okay, I mean, let's give it a whirl. I mean, everyone at home might be throwing up or enjoying it, so... Yeah. I guess, let me feel it. Here, let me, let me grab one of my I own. I mean, they just feel like just a regular paper, almost like they're ultra thin papers. Okay, so these come with 100 sheets, and this is only $10, which some of their stuff is a little more pricey, but $10 is not bad at all. 10 cents a paper. Right? So we, so I guess you just pull them out like that. Now, what are these little, here, we're gonna go for the zoom in, so you guys can see the, I guess the border, what would the you gum. call that? That's called the gum? That's the gum. And what is that for? That is for sticking it onto the other side when you roll. Ah, that's okay. The, uh, that's the gum to stick. I'm gonna keep it so real. I've never rolled a joint before. I'm like, mm-hmm, thank you. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna press this against my nose, just the top part, and let's just see what it looks like, I guess, when it's oily. I mean, when it absorbs the oil. Okay, I'm just gonna press it on my nose. Look, I'm gonna put that over my hand. Oh, you can definitely see it. Oh, yes, look at that. Oh, yeah, you can see it. Bitch, <laughs> she's that, oily! It almost makes like the paper see-through. Yeah. And then other parts I'm oily on are always my T-zone, so I'm gonna go right in between my brows. Oh, wow. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see this at home, but this one is definitely absorbing a lot. All right, so on this half that isn't used, I'm gonna hit up Nathan's uh, skin. Oh, okay. Come on, oil. Look, you can see my finger in the monitor now through the, through the paper. Mm -hmm. Nathan has like combination skin, so, oh wow. Yeah. Look at that. Ooh! All right, so when you see it against the backdrop, this is Nathan's side, and then this is my side. Mine looks a little more subdued because a tiny bit of my powder came off, which, yeah. is, which is not a bad thing. The claim was that it didn't disrupt your makeup, which my, everything looks in place. Yeah, everything looks Everything fine. looks snatched. But I also have like three layers of foundation, powder, contour, everything. So a tiny bit of makeup did come off on my side and then Nathan's is at the bottom. Ooh, 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 ooh. So we're gonna give Nathan this one. So off camera, he's gonna roll a normal one. And then right here, live, he's going to roll the oily joint. Oh my God, that sounds kind of disgusting. Hey, fuck it. <laughs> That oily joint, girl. We'll see how this goes. Right? Oh my god. All right, what kind of weed are we gonna smoke right now? This is some white berry. Oh, let me smell that. Yeah. Oh, it's like high sativa. Yeah. So what's easier to roll, joints or blunts? Um, blunts because you can lick that thing to death, but you get mm -hmm. one, one lick on a joint. 
on the paper because it's so thin. Well, yeah, no, and the gum, you can only lick that once and with a blunt, you can take the blunt apart and you can rewrap the thing. You can't do that to a joint paper. So we're gonna put in some, what is this, raw, natural, unrefined tips. So what does this mean? what does this do for anyone at home that's like, what the hell does that mean? It is a filter so you don't get weed in your mouth when you're sucking on the joint. Thank God. Thank God. I hate when you buy like a new glass piece and the weed goes right through and lands on your tongue and it's like, <laughs> not a good moment. Oh wow, so okay. Right in there. And that's, then voila. That's stays. it. Yeah, and then we just gotta grab a makeup brush and push the weed down in there. <laughs> So that's it. That's it. That was so easy. It was pretty, yeah. Wow. All right, milk makeup. It's not too bad. It's a little harder because the papers are really long. So, yeah. I mean, it's like the size of a blunt wrap, but paper. So it's definitely a little more difficult to roll <laughs> right. if, you if you don't know how to roll Wait, joints so that well. Wait, this is it, right? So this is the oiled one. That's the oiled one. So let's write that. Now he's about to off camera roll. I'm writing an O with a MAC liner on this because I just want to know. All right, the O is for oil. <laughs> All right, so now off camera, Nate is gonna roll a normal one that doesn't have our oil on it, and we'll be right back. All right, so this is the, of course, uh, joint we rolled with our own oils, and then that's a, like a regular one, right? Yes, this so is did the you, regular. Did you notice a difference when rolling it? Yes, that one definitely seemed a little like more flimsy than this one for sure. Okay, so the oils did kind of affect it. Oh yeah, definitely. But I mean, you did it quick though, so it wasn't like, yeah, yeah, it, I mean, it like hindered you. All right, I think we should, <laughs> well, I mean, we'll, we'll smoke this one later, later meaning in 10 minutes, but right. you wanna do the honors and spark this one? Yeah, let's do it. All, All right. right, here we go. Here we go. Watch that, oh, we might get some eyeliner in your mouth. <laughs> it's getting smoky in here. It's like that thousand degree knife challenge. Hmm, work. No eyeliner on my lips? Nope. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, a, I'm like a bull with my nose. Why did I blow that out my nose? <laughs> Fuck my life. <laughs> I'm like, I was. <clears throat> Is it good? Yeah. It tastes bomb. I mean, the weed tastes amazing. <laughs> Woo. You know what's really cool is that these, like, this is such a cool idea. I'm kind of jealous that I didn't think of it first. <laughs> All right, I think we're gonna take a few more hits and then let's dive into doing a little first impressions on these crazy sticks. All right, you down to be a, a little skincare guinea pig? Yeah, I'm down. All right, so Mel Makeup, they just recently put out these new, there's different types of sticks, okay? So okay. this is the cooling water stick. Cooling water stick. Yeah. Cooling water, it's a cool color, huh? Yeah, no, that's why I'm down. Okay, so basically, let's just read this. Here, you hold that, baby. So basically, this is a ultra cooling water stick that is supposed to soothe and invigorate. You wanna feel invigorated? Sure. I, I do. Now, it is infused with natural seawater and caffeine. All right, so basically it says to apply around your eyes to depuff, and then apply to your neck, face, and body to cool and refresh. Okay. So I guess we're gonna try this on you and see Just if it works. Just put it wherever the fuck you want, it sounds like. I guess. Now, <laughs> on the website, let's read this real quickly. It says that it's in, also infused with rich marine minerals. Okay, sounds it's a gel cool. stick that feels refreshingly cool to the touch and provides instant hydration that lasts all day. So it has caffeine, which is supposed to micro-circulate to give your skin an energized, glowing look. Damn. Oh, work. It's a mouthful. Eyes up. Very cooling. Really? Very cooling. Okay. It feels like ice touching your face. Whoa. Like a little bit. Yeah, it feels really cold. Right. Okay. Look up. Oh. Cool that jugular down and spread <laughs> that coldness through your body. Let's try on the back of his neck. That's so cold. Is it really? Yeah, it feels like. Whoa. Okay, your skin melted that off. Right? I'm like almost about to get the chills. Can you do the back of my neck? I want to see mm -hmm. if it works. I'm like, we ain't we trying these under eyes today, baby. <laughs> Does it feel cold? A little bit, yeah. It has like that weird, like cooling, almost like a um, like a Vicks vapor rub yes. type of cooling, but without without the crazy smell. Yeah, definitely. It doesn't smell. Yeah, like it doesn't anything. smell like anything. Probably the min I mean, the, it's minerals and water. So, okay, now now I want to try in the back of my. I'm gonna... Right, try mm. your neck. It's cold. Like it's. I mean, it's kind of chilly in here, and it's making it like the wind blowing. Yeah. Out. It's definitely cooling. It's not like a deep freeze type of feeling. No, no. But, but it's I definitely did. like, it's, it's definitely soothing. I'm like, I'm gonna try the back of my hand. Cool, okay, this actually works. I'm kind of shook about it. Now, no, it let funny. me look under your eyes to see about what they were talking about. It definitely has like, barely glow. Like obviously it's not trying to be a highlighter, 
but it definitely kind of gives your skin a little shimmer, a little shine to it, like a little bit of like, okay, honey, what's up, girl? Mm -hmm. Um, okay, cool. Let's try the other one. All right, um, that one worked. Yeah, no, I'm cool. All right, so this other one, I've seen so many people use this, and I know we've, we've been traveling so much in the internet of town, I haven't really used that yet. So I thought, why not try it on Nate? <laughs> so this is the Milk Blur Stick. Um, let me see, I threw away the box like a week ago. My bad. So basically it says that this is a colorless, oil and silicone free primer to blur the look of imperfections on all skin tone. Basically what it does is a blur stick minimizes the appearances of pores and fine lines on every skin tone for an invisible, smooth, matte, finish. Use as a primer for a smooth finish and to lock in your makeup. And it says it doesn't clog pores, which is nice. That's nice. Who wants some fucking clogged pores? Yeah. Nobody! <laughs> Alright, so this is also formulated without paraben, sulfate, la la la. Okay, also, yeah, it's vegan, it's cruelty free, and there's no oil or gluten in it. Work. So I'll probably use this on myself in a future video, of course, before my makeup, uh, <laughs> we, have a, we have a lot of layers on today. Now I've seen other YouTubers take their hand I mean, we don't have wrinkly hands, no, I mean, but they'll take it and like literally go on their hand and oh, whoa, it feels weird. It definitely looks blurred. It kind of does. Wait. Oh, it feels different. Feel my hand. It's almost like, yeah, it's literally like it feels matte, but it looks kind of glossy. Yeah, it feels like a, like a matte primer, kind of, almost like that Smashbox primer, but like it, it kind of blurred a little. I know it's probably so hard to see on camera, but it just looks yeah. a little different than the other hand. Huh. All right, let's try it on your face. <laughs> All right. All right, so I'm gonna do it on Nathan's like pore areas and forehead, and I guess let's see what the hell happens. Yeah, we'll try it out. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this side has the blur stick, this side has nothing. Let me see. I think I can see a difference. Does yeah, it? it looks a little more matte. Does it? I feel like I can see this line right here, but I can't see it over here. It definitely has a blurring effect. You can definitely see it. I think, I'm not sure how it looks on the footage yet, I will have to play back, but in person it does give you a little bit of like a, oh, did she face tune a tiny bit or did she? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it kind of worked. Now putting on makeup on top of it, that would be I guess the real test. Like right. if it really does blur your pores, I'm not about to slather foundation all over you. Um, but I will try it in a future video. If you guys want me to, let me know. Right. But, um, Milk Makeup came through. Now, I think in the past I've had, uh, hit or misses with their brand. Yeah. But, um, this new shit is amazing. I love brands that come up with innovative stuff. I think I've said that before with a few other brands. I just like things that are kind of out of the box. Um, I know blurring is really in now. A lot of brands are putting out blurring brushes, primers, everything. Oops, sorry. <laughs> it's actually worked. I will say this. This one, I mean, it did exactly what it said. So the cooling water stick is Jeffree Star approved. Now this one, I've seen it obviously on his face. It kind of looks a little blurry, right? but this is gonna be pending until I use it on myself and then do makeup over it. So pending. Now, final thoughts on the rolling blot papers. The rolling blot papers, I, I'm down with them. They're, I mean, I mean, they, they worked. I mean, yeah, I mean, if that you was, wanna- cool. If you, if you have use for the blottingness and rolling, but I mean, definitely buy them. Right, I mean, but I, if you're buying them just for the papers- I wouldn't buy them you, just for the papers. Obviously, they're $10. You can go buy a pack of papers for a couple bucks. Oh, okay. You can buy for a couple dollars. Okay, you know cool. I mean? So this is a little more luxury blotting yeah, papers. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thanks for hanging out, babe. Of course. <laughs> Love you guys. Mwah. Bye, guys. See ya. <laughs>